This project is a $277 million redevelopment of the St George Hospital campus. Uh, the centrepiece is an acute services building which co-locates all of St George's acute services like the operating theatres, the intensive care department uh, and the new helipad all on top of the existing emergency department. As part of this project we built eight new operating theatres and that combines with the current eight uh, to double the capacity at St George. Multiplex um, was pleased to be able to look at the possibility of installing airframe into St George Hospital. We went through an extensive feasibility study with health infrastructure and the users. We wanted to offer up as much innovation and value add to the project as we could. That's why we chose to offer that up to our client health infrastructure as a project innovation being the first airframe to be installed in Australia. Uh, we believe Airframe has a number of key benefits, both in the front end design, uh, the installation and then in the clinical outcomes that it delivers. The introduction of the Airframe from the perspective that the mounts for the pendants are integrated into the frame itself, clearing the way above the Airframe for other services. Bringing it earlier into design is one of the, one of the big risks that the air, Airframe helps to mitigate. So it helps you with the early planning or early coordination of the theatres and early user interface because it still gives you some time to finalise your design while you purchase the equipment. With the integrated lighting, with the integrated connections for medical gas and duct work, it means that on one day when you're installing in an operating theatre you have fewer trades trying to coordinate on site. That reduces a risk profile from an installation perspective. The physical installation of the airframe is, is, is much quicker, so um, from an installation perspective it is, it is superior than a traditional uh, operating theatre. I was shocked at how quickly airframe went in. Uh, it was a very fast install. Uh, airframe was up in the ceiling inside three hours. Where a traditional system would take you know, a number of weeks to install. The key risks that we try to manage on any project are safety, time, cost and quality. Airframe helps us reduce all of them. And the air filtering system in the Theatre 15 is uh, absolutely uh, fantastic because one of a sudden we feel very comfortable uh, operating where it's, where it's not hot, hot, it's just not hot, it's not cold. Some people are, you know, in the past used to complain it's quite hot or cold, etc. But most important that because of the air filtering system, uh, we don't actually see any dietary smoke. It disappears somewhere. You know, in the past when you actually even walk past the theatre, you can actually smell someone operating and using that. It means all the staff is, and the patient and the anaesthetist and the nursing staff is breathing all this smoke. And there is lots of evidence in the literature that uh, the smoke particles we ha can have the live DNA of a patient. So there's a high risk also of infection transmission. So therefore, uh, I mean, this air filtration system in Theater 15 is when you don't feel the smoke, it means you're operating in the health environment, which is another bonus. In the airframe study, we compared three operating rooms, one 26 years old, one uh, opened in November without airframe and operating room 15 with airframe. The study looked at air exchange, smoke evacuation and lighting for the operator. Yes, the preliminary results uh, came to us about two months ago after some high level uh, evaluation. It showed that there was significant difference between the three operating rooms. Obviously, the technology of 26 years ago was vastly different to today. However, the airframe was far better in the air exchanges and the reduction in the smoke hazards. The integrated lighting in room 15 with the uh, airframe system allows for a clearer, more visual aspect for the surgeon during the surgical procedure. It reduces the amount of shadow, thus ensuring that the surgeon is able to have a clear view and thus better outcomes for the patient. It's, all the facilities are absolutely spot on, really. You know, and as a surgeon, you actually, when you, when you make your operation flow, it's good for you, uh, it's good for a patient. Uh, we can perform more operations per day, more uh, sufficiency for the hospital, etc. From a multiplex perspective, the primary lessons learned for the project was to introduce the airframe at the earliest stage possible. The reason being, you want the airframe team to be an integral part of your design and coordination process, making sure that high level services coordination has already factored in the airframe as part of that process. I'd be interested in working with Wilhelm again on future projects. They have a track record of bringing innovative solutions to Australia. 
and they have a team that gets in, uh, does the hard work, builds strong relationships with the local hospital and delivers quality outcomes.